continuing to field more questions here about USMLE. So I have a student who's asking a very good question about the review of the UWorld self-assessment exams in relation to the NBMEs. I have made plenty of prior clips talking about how prior to step one, you're going to memorize NBMEs 20 through 30. Prior to step two, you're going to memorize NBMEs 6 through 11, as well as all of the clinical mastery series, the NBME subject specific forms, that from these NBME exams, all of this NBME content, you're going to be screenshotting your incorrects into a Word document, saving as a PDF slash PowerPoint for review. Okay. Now, this student's question is about, should I also be screenshotting the URL self-assessment exam incorrects into the PDF with the NBMEs? And the answer is absolutely no. Okay. And it's a very good question because no one's actually asked me that to date, but it, that should be articulated because no, we don't want you obsessing over the URL self-assessment exam incorrects. You will sit the U World, you will sit the UWSAs as you can, ideally prior to NBME 25 for step one and prior to NBME 9 for 2CK. That's a long discussion in and of itself. I don't want you sitting those exams too late. I know many of you guys want to sit those exams late, okay? But we want you getting the UWSAs out of the way, not worrying after you review the incorrects uh, one time, you're not going to uh, focus on them anymore. And then you're just going to go back into the NBME content, okay? It's really important that you recognize the real deal and the NBMEs are exactly the same. It's not my subjective opinion. It's not speculation. Objectively, there's repeats from the NBME exams all over the real deal, okay? The questions are exactly the same. That's why you need to focus on the NBME content, not fucking UWorld, okay? You know the deal. I'm going to continue to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.